We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. It, it, worst case scenario, I bring it home, put it in the fridge. We'll Even though Sam Skinner went to Duke, there's one thing he loves about Chapel Hill. Timeout's chicken cheddar biscuit. It's number one. The biscuit, unbelievable. You got some cheese on the biscuit and the chicken. It's game over. The game can't go on without a timeout for this treat. It's so popular that it attracted Man vs. Foods Adam Richman, which owner Eddie Williams didn't take well at first. And I'm really not up with a lot of the new shows or whatever, and they called me, um, and I thought it was a scam, and I hung up the phone. Once Williams found out he wasn't being fooled, he agreed to let Richmond and his show come. He said, I just want to come and focus on what you do. What do you do? And I said, I am known for chicken and cheddar biscuits and macaroni and cheese. And he said, that's what we're going to do. You may be wondering, what makes chicken, bread, and cheese so special? Well, add a little grease and a homemade touch, and you have what nearly 4 million people have eaten. And I see why. Time Out isn't the only famous eatery in the area. Cooking Channel featured Asian fusion restaurant Lantern, and Sunrise Biscuit Kitchen watered mouths on Travel Channel with its own chicken cheddar biscuit. Even Top This tried getting Guy Fieri from diners, drive-ins, and dives to chow down before it closed last year. It's possible that other area restaurants will follow in their footsteps, but in the meantime, only a few entice bellies on the telly. In Chapel Hill, I'm Paris Alston reporting.